Am I being charged? No, just being questioned. Well, you could have done that at the lair. This is an official investigation. We're going to do everything by the book. Now, right now, all I'm interested in is getting some answers, and we'll start with you two. I'll represent you if you represent me. Why do you always get the best end of the deal? Mason! We became the keepers of the corpse, so to speak. Sasha's, that is. We didn't come forward because there was too much circumstantial evidence pointing to us as the killers. That's not the most ethical approach, I admit, especially for two lawyers, but we were not exactly overrun with alternatives. So, we set out to find the real killer. Mission accomplished. You don't have a shred of evidence. Enough for an investigation. And I've already told you who to investigate. All right. I'll talk to you two outside. Ethan, I'll talk to you next. Right. What about me? Please. Am I free to go? No. We'll stay here. Look, would you give us a moment? Um, I'll take full responsibility. It's quite a, a cruel and, and rather public trick at the lair, Ethan. I'm don't... rather surprised at you. Should I apologize? I have watched our marriage go from something wonderful to sheer hell. And you pushed it to the edge. So is this uh, divorce real or just part of the show? Oh, it's real. So everything you've done to uh, destroy me and our marriage and yourself, I guess it's uh, anticlimactic that you should... Uh, try and kill me. But what was the point? I mean, the damage was already done. All right, give it to him. How do you want to play this? The truth is always nice. Just for okay. a change of pace. Okay. We don't have to tell him all of it. We're beyond covering, don't you think? Need I remind you how far we are from being out of the woods at this point? We may not have killed anybody, but it'll soon appear to the authorities that we've accomplished everything else but... I wanted to go to the police in the first place. You stopped me. No, Live with it. I don't have much choice, and neither do you. We could go to jail. We could both be disbarred. I'm sure that there are people who would look on two less lawyers in the world as being God's gift to civilization. I, on the other hand, love our house. I love the family that I'm hoping you're going to let me go back to once we put this all behind us. Besides, you look terrible in blue. Nathan. Feel free to take notes. Conspiracy to withhold evidence, breaking and entering, theft. What are you suggesting? That we have our cake and eat it, too. And don't forget to add trafficking cheap cliches to that list of charges. All I'm saying is we don't need to tell Michael everything. We skip the cryonics and hide him the corpse in my tomb and cut to the part where Sasha's body disappeared and Sidney began to haunt us. We say that we didn't go to the police because we were waiting for an extortion demand. It isn't lying, it's just omission. A good prosecutor is going to have a field day with us. Hell, a lousy one will make mincemeat out of us. Ethan is going to be prosecuting. I believe he has bigger fish to fry. Why make it worse than it has to be? We are not the lead players in this drama. The audience isn't going to mind if we forget a few lines. No, Mason, not this time. We tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. I'm tired of covering up and, and being afraid that I'm going to get caught. Besides, this is crazy enough. Maybe no one will believe it. Okay. Stanley, hold yeah. everything. Got a new witness. Is Asher in there? Yeah. Even? Williams, what are you doing here? Shannon over there? Oh, we had a little problem. Now, Miss Preston's fine, but we cut this patient from the sanitarium wiring your house. Wiring it? How? Well, in general, trying to blow you to kingdom come. Her name is Annie. Annie DiGirolo. Well, don't all apologize at once. 